Hey, what it is, YouTube? Delgo here with another unboxing. Um, this came actually maybe a week or two weeks ago, but uh, just finally unboxing it now because it's something I really didn't need to open. But uh, I ordered this from Amazon. This is the the Snooks uh, Chiba. That's the uh, Stato. So, uh, my dad picked this up from the uh, front door and he's thought I had already taken it out or the product out and he's like surprised on how lightweight these shoes were or these sandals whatever you want to call them I still call them shoes just because they're closed but still rocking my uh, snuck hemp's the uh, sidewalk surfers but, uh, that's pretty much it for that Right here is pretty much just a cardboard box and it came in like this little baggie. Um, I have an invoice. Um, this came actually one day ahead of schedule of what it was expected. And it was about a week. I did the uh, free shipping and handling, um, whatever, three to five or something, business days or whatever it is that. Um, Amazon has, but in total the price um, was forty six dollars and eight cents. Um, these again are the Sanuk Men's Chiba Sidewalk Surfer, uh, tan color. That there. What we got here? The last time I bought mine at Shields, it's a like a sporting goods uh, sports store or whatever. That has a variety of everything: um, golf, outdoor, uh, hiking. They have soccer, basketball, whatever, any sport you name it. Archery, hunting. But anyways, what do we got here? This bag is biodegradable, reduced, reuse, um, compost. Got some bananas. Let's see. You can reuse this bag. Smile, pass on. Possible uses for this bag. You can. Use this bag to dispose kitchen waste. Dispose of this bag in your city yard waste bin. So that whatever. Looks like I got a little hanger. So these ones are pretty much just like the last style I bought. I can probably bring those down to show you. But this is these are not shoes. They're sandals. Kind of like a. Um, you got the Snook brand on the top. Just a little hanger thing for your shoes. I don't know what I'll use that if I just throw that away. Has little smiley faces on the bottom. Same kind of uh, outer sole um, as the other Snooks that I have. Same got the, uh, they have the same uh, Aegis microbe shield right there. Prevents uh, bacterial growth and smell. Same as my other ones, if you want to check those out, you can check that video, but this is just pretty much an unboxing. Um, pretty much the same uh, bottom. One thing about this one, it's a little bit thicker on the outside compared to my other ones. I can bring those others. been over maybe a year or so since I've had these. These are my Snook Hemp's. I can show you, I guess, the comparison. Almost pretty much look the same. Looks like they both got the Snook green label. Right there, there's some new ones in my old ones. Um, this has kind of that colored insole lining and it's a little bit thinner. This has a, I don't know, it's like thicker on the outside here but they pretty much look the same and I really like these and these color um, I was gonna get the Kingston the old ones the Kingston ones not the Kingston 2's just because of the color but I think they're all sold out and they didn't have my size you can see the wear and tear of my old ones just kinda wears the ball of the foot and then on the edges and drag my heels quite a bit but uh, the color has stayed pretty intact. Uh, my right foot has I don't know, some discoloration on the front 
you can see this here you see here but other than that really love these guys super lightweight and uh, the bottom actually once you wear these enough times will kind of um, in groove or indent or like mold to the bottom of your foot kind of and form like in a, like a cast or a, a mold anyways to your foot and so it becomes I don't know, somewhat aligned or adjusted to your actual foot so it makes it really comfortable and it's almost like you're walking on like this soft like leathery uh, pillow even though it doesn't seem like that's th that thick it gives you enough support where it's really I don't know fun just to walk in just very comfortable you can walk around with these in the sh in at home or outside uh, like today pretty much just I wore these went to the Incredibles or not the Incredibles the Avengers wore them with a pair of jeans um, I don't know, they just pretty much go with anything. You wear cargo shorts, uh, khakis. Uh, yeah, sometimes I wear these as business casual. Wear these at the pharmacy. It's, I don't know, pretty nice. But again, these are the Snook Hemp's, both sidewalk surfers. This is the, uh, these are the new ones, the sidewalk surfer of uh, Chibus. Different, a little bit, slightly different style. Same color, tan. Um, this is actually called, I think, hemp. This is made out of hemp material. Um, this is probably, what is this, let me double check, this is almost like hemp too, but, whatever, go get yourselves a pair, that, peace, oh yeah, by the way, The Avengers, amazing movie, actually I've seen it twice now, the, this time I saw it in 3D, last time I saw it on uh, opening weekend on Saturday, just very busy, even busy today, that's been a week past, um, still like a full theater it's pretty fun to go through like a, a theater that's full you get the old uh, ambiance of the uh, comical parts and the movie is actually pretty funny the Hulk does a pretty good job as, as does uh, uh, Iron Man both both making it um, very comical and a lot of humor pretty much with uh, mixed in with action so it's a great movie uh, I would recommend not going to the 3D it's not I don't think it's worth it um, to me anyways one I don't like putting glasses on or wearing something extra I, I, won't, I don't need but the 3D effects eh. I think there's just some particle effects that pop out on the screen like it's stuck like uh, a lot of video games have that blood on the, the screen or like uh, when it rains or water water effects that gets stuck on the screen. I know Guild Wars has that water effect when you jump out or jump into um, the water, but pretty much it for the 3D part. Uh, stick around for the the ending. There's a it's not too far into the credit. Just wait wait along to the very end. Anyways, um, usually most theaters will remain dark or black. And they won't turn the lights on until that part's played. So stick around if you haven't seen it. Peace.